Hey everyone, this is Alex or Polymomo T, and today I have a video showing how to make this cute little ice cream cone with a bunny and a cat out of polymer clay and resin. So first we're going to make the templates for the bunny head. So I'm taking a ball of clay and I'm flattening it out slightly. And I'm taking a smaller ball of clay and I'm rolling into a fat cylinder. And I'm cutting off the ends and these will be the two bunny ears. And I'm going to place that on top of my head. And I want to bake that according to instructions. Next we're going to make the cat and I'm going to do the same thing with the head. And this time I'm going to roll a little cone out of polymer clay. And I'm going to cut off the end and blend that onto my head and let that bake according to instructions. And once fully baked, you want to make a mold out of it out of some silicone mold maker. Next, we're going to do the resin mixtures. So I'm going to start with the bunny first. I got some UV resin along with some glitters and some white pigment along with some pink pigment. And I poured my mixture into my mold, making sure that it gets in all the parts of the bunny ears so there are no bubbles. And then once cured under the UV lamp, I took it out. Next, for the cat head, I added some UV resin along with some red pigment. And I forgot to add the glitter first, but I added it later on in the video. And just to give it a little bit more pizzazz, I decided to add some pearls to it. So I'm adding my UV resin mixture into the mold and I'm popping in some pearls. And I added more UV resin along with more pearls and I continued to repeat until it was fully filled. Then once cured, I took out my little cat head out of the mold. Next I took some white clay and we're going to use this to make the cone. So I rolled it into a cone shape. Then I cut off the end and let that bake according to instructions. Then I took some very thin washi tape and I decided to decorate my cone using some washi tape. And this is the first time I tried this method. Next step, we're going to make some sprinkles. So I'm taking some clay I'm rolling into a snake and I'm cutting it into little pieces. Then after rolling them into little balls, I rolled them into little cylinders. And I repeated that until I had a lot of different colors. Next, I really wanted to make a cherry on top, so I got a ball of red clay. And then I rolled a snake of brown clay and I cut a little segment out. And then using a dotting tool, I made a little indent in the middle of my cherry and I added the little brown stock to it. Next, I added some super glue onto my little cone and I glued that onto the bottom of my cat head and let the super glue dry. Then for extra reinforcement, I decided to give it a layer of glaze onto the cat head so it stays completely in place. Then I'm using some white UV resin mixture that I got from Miniature Sweets and I decorated the top of the cat head along with some sprinkles to go on top. Then after letting that cure, I added another layer of UV resin to stick on my bunny piece onto the cat head and let that cure. And then it was the fun part to decorate the bunny, so I added some pink UV resin mixture onto the bunny head along with some sprinkles. And we can't forget the cherry on top. And I decided to add some white UV resin onto the ears as well and added some more sprinkles on there just to make it super decorated. And once that was cured, I gave it a layer of UV resin to give it a nice glaze. And I gave it, of course, the signature dot eyes and a line smile. And let that cure under the UV lamp. Then I repeat the same steps with the cat head. And of course, I also had to give it the signature dot eyes and a line smile as well.
And once fully cured, here you have your little cat bunny ice cream cone scoop, double scoop, uh, resin and polymer clay charm. And I hope you guys enjoyed. You don't have to decorate it the way I did. You can change it up and mix it up with different animals. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.